In this video, I'm going to explain about Azure DevOps account creation. I'm not going to explain completely about Azure DevOps in this video. I'm just going to explain a couple of fundamental concepts that are required to be learned before going to the Azure DevOps concepts. Uh, firstly, I'll try to explain what is Azure DevOps. So if you want to understand what is Azure DevOps, I can say Azure DevOps is not a software. It is not a tool. So it is basically a process that is going to enable developers and operation teams to work together, which will help to further quality and speed of software developments. And if I just want to give you a simple snippet or simple diagram, which we all are aware because nowadays we have these diagrams available in all over the internet. I'll try to present one of those diagram and I'll explain you with some small examples. So here you can see a snippet of Azure DevOps process where you can see there is a development team and where is, there is a operations team. So in development, if you are looking to develop a software, basically they will have a plan and with the plan they will build the code and then they will go for the testing and deployments. So once after that, it will go for the UAT or test environment deployments where the operation team will be monitoring it and they will be operating it like say they will be uh, looking for the issues or they will be identifying what exactly the functionality what exactly the behavior and what needs to be updated or what needs to be changed they will make uh, in I mean they will make the results as an input to the development team so basically DevOps is a process or a methodology which will enable development team and operations teams to work together for the enhancement of software developments. So this is what DevOps means in simple. So let's go and understand the Azure uh, DevOps account creation. Let's go and create Azure DevOps account. So in the process of Azure DevOps account creation, it will ask us to create the Azure DevOps organization. Whereas the organization is the top hierarchy under which we can create multiple DevOps projects and we can develop our softwares. So when I want to create a Azure DevOps account, I can create my Azure DevOps account using dev.azure.com or I can log into Azure portal. In the Azure portal, I can search for Azure DevOps organization and from there I can create my Azure DevOps account and the Azure organization. To create Azure DevOps account, we have two options. Uh, the first option is we can directly go to dev.azure.com. Here we can click on start free to create our Azure DevOps free account. Once I click on start free button, it will ask me to log into Azure DevOps services. But since I don't have any account, I need to first register for Azure DevOps account. If in case, if you are already having Azure account, in that case, we no need to go and register for Azure DevOps account separately. In Azure portal itself, if we search for Azure DevOps, we can see an option here, Azure DevOps organization. So once I click on this option, it will take me to Azure DevOps page. In this Azure DevOps page, I can see the message related to Azure DevOps billing and subscription. We can ignore this message for now since we are using a Azure free trial account already. Now we can go and click on this option, my Azure DevOps organization. I'll click on this. It is taking me to another browser. Here you can see the URL dev.azure.com and you can see the information about the account with which I'm trying to log in. Here it is showing me a message, get started with Azure DevOps. Uh, if I click on create new organization, it will take me to a page where it is giving me a message, get started with Azure DevOps. And if you would like to get any information and tips from Azure DevOps, you can check this option and click on continue. In case if you want to switch your directory, you can change your directory by selecting this options. Once we click on continue button, it is asking me to create a Azure DevOps organization. So I'm giving here uh, Azure DevOps organization name as Cloud Learner 
pro 001 and then we are hosting uh, this particular organization projects in South India I'm okay with that after that I'm entering the captcha and I'll click on continue you can see the message taking you to the Azure DevOps organization that means it is creating Azure account and the organization with the details that we provided in the previous steps so it will not take more than one two minutes because i have created multiple organizations in my azure retail account and it will create within very less amount of time here you can see the azure devops organization is created and i can see the account uh, with which i logged in you can see this uh, portal url dev.azure.com and if you see the complete url this is our azure devops organization url so this is a process of creating azure devops account and the azure organization so i hope this is very simple and easy step so if you're finding any errors or if you're facing any issues in the process of creating your azure devops account and organization you can mention the comments in this video section i can go through it and i can help you if at all if you are finding any errors in this process